Fans think Chase Hudson and Charlie D'Amelio are back together. Here is everything we know. I'm Gabby Conti. I'm Jana Rosenberg, and this is your 24-7 Celebrity News. It seems like it is the season for TikTok couples to reunite. First, we're seeing that Bryce Hall and Addison Rae, or Bradison, are hanging out more and more and making fans convinced they are for sure back on. And now, Charlie D'Amelio and Chase Hudson just posted their first video together since they announced their breakup on Instagram stories a few months ago. Since the breakup, fans were already speculating that the two were talking and still into each other. Just recently, before the Hype House moved, Thomas Petro wallpapered Chase Hudson's room with the same headshot of Charlie D'Amelio, which looked like Thomas was teasing his friend on his obvious crush on his ex-girlfriend. Yeah, I mean, well, no, nope, not ex-girlfriend. Remember, they didn't I have knew, a title. I yeah, I was waiting for that. However, <laughs> I it annoys me. Like, they, they were, were, were together. together. <laughs> okay? Call it what you want, okay? We're, us millennials will call it ex-girlfriend, ex-boyfriend. Yeah, Gen, Gen Z. Z. Like, whatever you want to call it, okay? It's so true. It is so true. I know. It's so frustrating. Um, okay, so if you remember Chase and Charlie, they split a few months ago after allegations from a diss track that Chase was sliding into other girls' DMs. Then Chase and Charlie both posted statements on their Instagram stories saying that they mutually broke up and they both do still care about each other. Then Charlie and her sister Dixie left the Hype House, although the sisters swear it wasn't for personal reasons and actually for business reasons only. Totally. Uh, yeah, I, I kind of believe that. I don't, I don't really know know why they left the house. I mean, I think business reasons doesn't make sense. You can still do personal business deals while you're part of a collective. Yeah. I highly doubt Thomas Petro was having those girls sign anything that was like, you can't, you know what I mean? That Find just doesn't him. make yeah, sense. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. Um, plus, they made, they, those girls are like the most, Charlie's the most followed girl on TikTok. Right. Like she made the hype house. So I don't know why they left. I think it was probably a mix of the breakup of the pandemic and of what is going on with the Hype House. I felt like things were changing every month, so. And it also could be, I mean, at the time that she left, uh, her family was like hyper-focused on this reality show, which yes. seemed to have turned into a podcast of Charlie and Dixie. So it could have been that. It also could have been coming from maybe Charlie's family, mm -hmm. which is why, like, business reasons, because we know her family does run her Definitely. business. Um, but now we've actually been seeing, Dixie has been hanging out at the clubhouse a lot, and I think Charlie has been hanging out at the clubhouse a oh, lot, really? too. Oh, really? So, who knows? It That's could also be that could be the direction they're going in, or maybe they want to just be free agents and like not have be affiliated with any okay. house. Since the split, it appeared that Dixie and Charlie were quarantining with their parents in Connecticut. But since LA is beginning to slowly open back up, it looks like the D'Amelio sisters are back in town. Dixie reuniting with her Attaway General co-star and possible boyfriend, Griffin Johnson, and now Charlie reunited with Chase in a way that suggests they might be back together. This is possible since the two seem to have split on good terms as they stayed in contact, being friendly and supportive towards each other since the split. So, yeah, I mean, they, they didn't, I mean, besides the cheating allegations, like, they ended saying they love and support each other. We know they were in contact while they were broken up. It's not, like, completely out of the blue that they would get back together. No, I mean, I think it's very possible. I also think, like, distant, like, they broke up after they went back to Connecticut. Yeah. The girls went back to Connecticut. Yeah. So, I mean, I feel like when you're in the same town with someone or you're in the same friend group, whatever it is, it's really difficult to stay broken up with someone that you had such deep feelings for and it really seemed like these two did. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know. I feel like we might see them really reunite here very soon. I think so too, I do. So these reunion rumors, they come after Charlie just posted a TikTok in what appears to be the new Hype House pool, using the same track and dance moves as Addison and Bryce Hall recently did, which also has made fans suspect that Bradison was back on. Charlie posted a video of her in a bikini doing the reel it in motion as she reels Chase in like a fish. So in the video with Addison and Bryce, Bryce was the one reeling Addison in, so it's the same track, same move, and now Char Charlie's doing it, so it's almost like it's a nod to like, oh, this is how TikTok couples are official by posting that TikTok. Right. I, I cannot wait to go get on TikTok after this and yeah. like watch all those videos. Oh, and she captioned it, the boy, and tagged Chase Hudson. So the boy is kind of something that you would call your huh. boyfriend, yeah. right? So as we report this story, that is the latest and greatest with Charlie and Chase. I am sure if you're staying tuned and watching their socials, you will be seeing much more things that make them look TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat official. Definitely. For sure. Um, what do you guys think is going on here? Are Charlie and Chase back together? Do you think they'll get back together? Let us know your thoughts. I'm Gina Rosenberg. I'm Gabby Conti, and follow us at Hollywire for your 24-7 celebrity news.